The Mosquito Creek segment of the extension of the Solomon Hochoy Highway from San Fernando to Point Fortin is 75% completed. Minister of Works and Transport Rowan Sinanon, along with officials from NIDCO, IECOM Engineering, and the Junior SAMI, toured the project on Wednesday. Minister Sinanon indicated that the Mosquito Creek was the most technical part of the entire highway as the area was below sea level and was prone to flooding. This area was below sea level, so you have the, the basically swamp land that you have to build in and constructing a highway on. Very technical, and I'm happy that the Junior Sami was able to, you know, work with the consultants where we could actually raise this one closer two meters, yeah. closer two meters in certain areas, and hopefully going forward we should avoid the flooding that normally takes place. Minister Sinanan said the package for the Mosquito Creek portion of the highway, which cost an estimated $281 million, was well within budget. He explained that the rebutment and the seawall are still under construction, and barring any setbacks caused by the pandemic and inclement weather, the estimated completion date is January 2022. We're all aware that we're in a pandemic, and uh, we have some inclement weather which is not predictable. So... Although we had a completion date uh, at the third quarter in 2021, as you are aware since last year, that had to be delayed a bit. Um, but what is quite significant is that all 12 packages, work is going on, the five local contractors have done human service. They have proven to us that they can get the job done. And today we're just going to each uh, area to see firsthand and to get a fair idea as to what